harass you? You are the one that is ringing our doorbell in the middle of the night to scare my children. Setting off fireworks. No, that was somebody else. somebody else in your on your property. I have video of it. Somebody else set off. Okay, yeah. Show the video to the cops and somebody else. It wasn't us. It looks like you guys on video. Harass you. That's funny. That's funny. Oh, what are you going to take me to court for? Would you like to settle? For what? For what? Because you keep threatening me. I am not threatening you. My, I came over and got my dog from the fence. How did I threaten you? I told you not to talk to me. How did I threaten you? Yeah, uh, that's not a threat. That's the truth. Your dog can bark. Mike's dog can bark. Those dogs and those dogs can all bark. My dogs cannot bark. No. Yes, you do. I don't. I do not. I have a terrible neighbor problem. Okay, John. George. Let it go. Nicest guy I have ever And he doesn't like you. What does that tell you? No, I don't disrespect him. How do I disrespect him? That's why I said, do not talk to me. What part of that do you not understand? Okay, I will never talk Good. to you. Good. Don't. Again. Don't talk to me. Don't Where talk to my children. You? God bless you. I don't believe in God. I'm an atheist. No, I'm an atheist. But Thank you. But to harass me, how do I harass you? What have I ever done? I called the cops when you set off fireworks, and I called the cops when you rang our doorbell in the middle of the night and scared my children. Hey, you know what? We're sound asleep, and you know it. Sure. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay, the same you, day that you start a fight with us. So no. No. Yes, it, for seven and a half years, I was nothing but nice to you. I don't know what you're talking about. And I was seven and a half years. Had the dogs nice to you. Two years. I've had I the dogs for three years. I, well, three years, and you didn't do anything. You know what? You, had the dogs for three you know what? Years it didn't bother you. Didn't it didn't bother you. I'm sorry. I talked to your mom. You didn't talk to her. I you yelled at her. Died. You yelled at her. You, you, you yelled at her. Yeah, that's what her and George both said, is that you yelled over the fence. You know what, she's working, because she works for a living, unlike you, yeah, collecting but, disability. You know, the last time I saw her, I'm trying to apologize, first thing out of her mouth, it doesn't matter. Because she don't want to talk to you. She can't wait to die. Because she don't want to talk to you. I don't think Because you have upset her. She is sick, and you keep on stressing her out with this bull crap. And I am sick. Because all of a sudden, out of the blue, you decide to threaten her. Okay. okay. Yeah, you're disabled, all right. Disabled. You're so disabled. I see out here on your knees every day. You're disabled, all right. I like to see you get a job. You must be disabled. Oh, no, you know what? And you know what? You know what? We make enough money that I don't have to have a job, okay? I take care of my children. That's what I do. Oh, what? You've seen me, what, playing with my son every day in the yard? Is that what you've seen? You know what? You want to be mad at me? Fine. I am sorry. I'm just saying, don't talk to me. I didn't threaten you. I haven't harassed you. I haven't bothered you. Yeah, you're adults. You're ringing the doorbell. You know, you started it with videotaping our yard behind our backs. Oh, just like you're doing? Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm right here. Hey, I'm not a coward like you. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. No, my life is being the neighborhood watch to keep my house safe from people like you. Who want my children to be in danger. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah. You want to talk to Mike and Dan and Matt and Shelly? You want to talk about how many friends you have? Yeah, none of them. You know why? Because oh, they all help you out. Oh. They all help you out. Oh, it's my That's fault. why. That's why. It's not your fault. No. It's my fault. Why? You know, I don't want friends in this neighborhood. People who terrify my children in the middle of the night are not worthy of being friends with me. Okay? George, stop yelling at me.